Hey, what's up guys? It's Josh here. I'm here with Coach T and we're going to go over this week's Fast and Furious Fat Furnace workout for you. So for this workout, we're actually going to do two groups of five exercises. You're going to go 15 seconds of hard work, 15 seconds to switch. We're going to do five, five, we're going to go through the first five group, the first five exercises five times. Then we'll go through the second group of five exercises for five rounds. You ready, T? I'm ready. Okay, so we're going to start with our ball hammer slams here. So grab that slam ball. You make that big circle as you pick that ball up. Reach like you're going into your back pocket and then reach high overhead. Sit back and slam that ball down. You're going to alternate side to side each slam. I want you to think about trying to break that ball as you slam it down. The second exercise is our rows on our TRX. So leaning straight back, glutes squeeze tight, knee gets pulled up. Push that air out as you pull yourself up here. Deep breath in, pushing out. Glutes are squeezed. Everything's working to make this heavier. You step further in. If you need to make it lighter, you can put one foot back or both feet back here to lighten up that load enough so you can get those good reps in. From there, we're gonna to go to our goblet squats. So you can grab a kettlebell or a dumbbell. You're gonna hold in that goblet position right there at your chest, elbows in tight. Sit back into that chair, deep breath in. Push that air out. Think about spreading the floor with your feet, pushing those knees apart as you squat down and drive up, squeeze those glutes tight at the top. Our fourth exercise is our power step up. So grab a box. And we're gonna go up and over on that box. Use those arms for momentum. Drive that box right into the floor. Push that air out as you explode up here. Nice, don't think you take the impact out. You're just gonna step side to side, one step at a time. And our last exercise of the first round is going to be push-ups. So, push-up plank position, squeeze those shoulder weights, push that air out as you press up. Glutes are squeezed tight, kneecaps pulled up. You can go down from the toes, up from the toes. You go down from your toes, lower your knees, and press up from your knees. You can also work from your knees or use the suspension trainer for that chest press as well. And we're gonna go through those five, five times, and then we're gonna switch it up. So our first exercise in the second group, we're doing ball slam burpees here. So reach high overhead, slam that ball down, kick those feet back, slam those feet outside your hands, and then reach high overhead. Kicking them back, back and forth here. If you want to, you can go with that step back burpee. So just one leg back at a time. You can also just do that traditional ball slam here if you need to. The second exercise is our chest press on the suspension trainer. So we're gonna get those, you're gonna get in that moving plank position on the balls of your feet here, knuckles turned down, squeeze those shoulder blades and push yourself back up. It's a deep breath in on the way down, your whole body's moving down. Push the ground away from you as you press back up here, nice and controlled. If you want to, you can put one foot forward to kind of lighten that load, and make sure you get a full range of motion here. Then the third exercise is our TRX triple squat. So turning around, facing that anchor point, elbows at your ribs. We're gonna go lunge, lunge, squat here. So it's a lunge on each leg and a squat with both legs. And you're also, if you wanna take it up a notch, you can go lunge, jump, Lunge, jump, squat, jump here. Deep breath in on the way down. Push that air out as you're exploding up. Then we're gonna go to our step up press here. So for this one, we're gonna grab two dumbbells. We're gonna do it with both hands here. You're gonna get one foot up on that box. You're gonna drive up and press those dumbbells up to the ceiling. Deep breath in, push that air out as you press on up, nice and controlled. If you want, you can also, or excuse me, when you come back around, you'll switch that leg. So you'll do one set on one leg. When you come back around, switch up the leg that you're stepping up with. And then our last exercise of the workout is gonna be our mountain climber. So if you want to, you can pull that blue floor down here. Sliders, we need sliders. Do we know? Do, do we? You do, you can do. Okay, so if you want, you'll get your feet set up on those sliders, shoulders over those wrists. You're gonna drive one knee up, drive that other leg back as quickly as you can. You can slow it down to get more intentional if you need to. You can also do this without the sliders, driving those knees up, pushing the ground away from you, or you can hold that plank for that 15 seconds as you're getting tired, whatever works best for you. Okay, that's our Fast and Furious Fat Furnace workout for this week. Great job, team.